Political parties have been challenged to conduct free and fair primaries to, held up, to help uphold democracy and constitutionalism ahead of the next general election in Cliffy County. Aspirants seeking tickets on the Pomoja African Alliance Party platform want the outfit to guarantee them a transparent and bipartisan process. Kilife County Governor Amazon Kinki has been urged to address some teething problems as the Pamoja African Alliance Party prepares to conduct its primaries. Ninini kitatufanya sisi to see collect 100% ndani ya Kilife. Na hiyo ndio nguvu ambayo ninayo kwa sababu ninajua kwamba kama ni mikakati tuko navyo tumejipanga tuko kwa ground almost every day. Na ndio sababu tunasema sisi wanapaa tutapaa ndani ya Kilife na coast region na Kenya nzima. A section of party hopefuls argues that PAA must demonstrate that it speaks to the needs of the people it purports to represent. Tutashirikiana kama wanachama wa PA. Na hata tukipitwa katika hata tukiwa tumemaliza kwenye 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 primaries wale ambao watakuwa hawaku hawakufaulu kwenye primaries tumekubaliana hatutawaacha mkono tutashikana nao tutatembea pamoja Meanwhile the Iteso Council of Elders has thrown its weight behind former Funyula member of parliament Paul Otuma's campaign for the Busia gubernatorial seat The elders also endorsed former Teso North MP Arthur Odera as the running mate So let us not convert an election contest to kuje tuingize even cultural things ambazo jamii zimeishi pamoja tuanze kufakana mato Elsewhere, a section of Kajiado leaders want the government to crack the whip on warmongers. The leaders said there should be no room for political intolerance. Siasa hakuna mtu ambayo atachukua uongozi ama viti vya siasa kwa kutumia njia ya nguvu. Viti ambavyo tunaomba ni wananchi ambao wanatupatia. Pauliza wasitumie vijana vibaya tafuta kula pole pole kama una shughuli au kama upendi mgombea fulani wacha kusubua mkutano wako watu akila mtu ajieleze kwa wananchi wananchi wataamua in machakos county mavoko member of parliament patrick makau has called on wiper party leader kalonzo musyoka to guarantee fairness in nominations to avert a fallout speaking in machakos town makau alleged that his challenger wavinya ndeti was rooting for direct nomination a route that may lock out formidable candidates tunataka tuzindikishe kwamba chama ya wiper itupe eh, sisi ambao tunapigania iki kiti cha ugavana machakos county usawa wa kufanya ile inaitwa party primaries mm. na sisi tunaamini kama wanachama ha, hatutakubali mtu apewe direct nomination kwa sababu kuna wengine ambao ninashindana na hao mm. yule mpinzani wangu anasema kwamba eh, ashapewa hii tikiti na ndio tumeungana hapa tukiwa wanachama wa Waipa Machakos County tuseme kwamba sisi eh, haitakuwa vizuri Similar concerns have been raised by a section of ODM aspirants in Kisi County. Speaking in Kisi Town, the aspirants called for transparency in the party's electoral process. Speaking in Kisi Town, the aspirants called for transparency in the party's electoral process. Isti sote za nomination ni sira ambazo zimewekwa pamoja. Tuweze kuwa na nakara ya mbali mbali ili tuweze kuona hizo list ni akina nani wamewekwa huko na nchi ya gani inafanywa. Kupitia kwa hii nomination nadhani ndio hii inaleta matatizo pengine kukufikia watu wengine kuwawa. Why is it possible for candidates to even campaign in all the wards in Nyaribari Masaba? So my question is, is NEB trying to build the party or they are in another business that we don't understand? Because, because as a party, our business is to win an election.